Growth Hormone Objectives Know the structure and site of synthesis of growth hormone. Estimate the role of growth hormone in various metabolic and non-metabolic processes. Recognize the regulation of growth hormone secretion. Estimate some clinical correlates, structure of growth hormone. Growth hormone is a single polypeptide composed of 91 amino acid. Have four cysteine residues in it, between them there is disulfide bonds. There is overall two disulfide bonds. Growth hormone can bring about some of the actions of prolactin and human placental actogen, HPL, due to amino acid sequence homology, site of synthesis and secretion of growth hormone. Growth hormone is synthesized in the anterior pituitary and released from there. Two hypothalamic hormones influence the synthesis and release of growth hormone which are Growth hormone releasing hormone Growth hormone release inhibiting hormone, somatostatin, control of growth hormone secretion As we know, growth hormone is secreted from the pituitary gland. The secretion of this hormone is regulated by releasing and inhibiting hormones that released from the hypothalamus. Growth hormone releasing hormone that released from the hypothalamus stimulate the release of growth hormone from the pituitary, while somatostatin, also called growth hormone release inhibiting hormone, will inhibit the release of it. You should know that the main target for growth hormone action is liver. In liver, growth hormone will stimulate the synthesis of a compound called, insulin-like growth factor, 1, and also called somatomedin. This insulin-like growth factor minus 1 will bring most of the effects of growth hormone on bone and cartilage. For regulatory axis regulate the secretion of growth hormone. 1 growth hormone releasing hormone and somatostatin from the hypothalamus causing stimulation and inhibition of growth hormone from the anterior pituitary respectively. 2 growth hormone will act on anterior pituitary causing decrease in growth hormone secretion. 3 insulin like growth factor action on pituitary will decrease the secretion of growth hormone. 4 insulin like growth factor action on hypothalamus by stimulating of somatostatin and inhibition of growth hormone releasing hormone will eventually inhibit the secretion of growth hormone from pituitary, duration and mechanism of action of growth hormone. The hormone acts slowly requiring from 1-2 hours to several days before its biological effects are detectable. The hormone acts by binding to specific membrane receptors on its target cells. But its exact mechanism of action and the second messenger are not yet known, the effect of growth hormones on minerals. Growth hormone aids in retention of nitrogen, phosphor, calcium, sodium, chloride, potassium and magnesium. So it causes positive nitrogen balance. The retention of P and Ca have a major role in the buildup of bony materials and hence, growth, the effect of growth hormone on proteins. Growth hormone facilitates the entry of amino acids to cells. This will lower blood amino acids level and urea level. This will make positive nitrogenous balance and will aid in protein synthesis. Protein synthesis includes all tissues, including the bones. Bones have large amount of proteins, the effect of growth hormone on fat. This hormone activates hormone sedative lipase growth hormone tissue, leading to increase in the level growth of circulating fatty acids. Growth hormone to increase in the level of circulating fatty acids. Hormone has an opposite effect to insulin. It aids in gluconeogenesis and glycogenesis. This is probably due to increase the amount of precursor matter fatty acids. Also, GH reduce the sensitivity of insulin and thus reduce the hypoglycemic effect of insulin, the effect of growth hormone on bones. Main target for GH action is liver. In liver growth hormone will bring another peptide to action, called insulin-like growth factor, along with metals retention, especially sodium and calcium, this will aids in bone and cartilage growth, growth hormone mimic the action of other hormones. Due to homology in structure with prolactin, GH could stimulate the growth and enlargement of mammary glands. 